One really common thing that I see people who are just getting started with Kajabi struggling with is understanding the difference between website pages and landing pages and understanding your navigation menu or menus and how all those things are connected together. So in this video, I'm going to explain to you the difference between website and landing pages and explain how to create a website using so when you get into your Kajabi account for the first time, you're gonna see a bunch of website pages listed. These are all placeholders that Kajabi has created for you. What's important to understand here is that just because those pages exist in your Kajabi account doesn't mean that anybody can get to those pages. Likewise, if you go into landing, you can create a bunch of different landing pages, but same thing just because they're there doesn't mean that people can automatically get to them. So all those pages might exist, but the thing that transforms them into a website is your navigation menu. And creating a navigation menu is how you decide which pages you want available to people and what order you want them listed in. So the, when you have those pages, it's like loose sheets of paper and then you're gonna bind them together into a book using a navigation menu. So that's what I'm gonna show you now in this video is how to create that navigation menu that turns these loose pages into a website. We're gonna talk about your website pages, landing pages, and header navigation, and how they're all connected to each other. So when you log into Kajabi, if you go down on the left-hand side panel to website and then pages, you're going to see these three headers across the top, website, landing, and funnels. What this means is you have website pages, landing pages, and funnel pages. Right now, we're just talking about website and landing pages. We're going to ignore funnel pages for now. Under website pages, you're going to see these. There are 13 website pages on this account. These are all the pages that my Kajabi account came loaded with. These are the 13 pages that Kajabi kind of thinks of as comprising a website and or some of them are pages that control access to some content. So the login page, somebody needs to log in to be able to access anything. Once they do, they're taken to a library where they can only see the products that they have purchased or, or gotten access to somehow. So those are, those are your website pages. There are more, this uh, member directory um, announcement. These are, if you see the little lock icon, it means it's a members only page. That's something that somebody needs to be logged into in order to gain access to the content on that page. What's important to understand is that these 13 website pages, just because they're here, doesn't mean that people can automatically see them or gain access to them you need to set up a navigation menu or share the link with people in order for them to actually see these pages. Same thing with your landing pages. You can create a hundred landing pages here, but no one would be able to see them until you somehow connect them all together. It's like just sheets of paper, and then you need to bind them together into a book in order for them to be connected to each other. And the way that we do that is through your navigation, which again is on the left-hand side panel under website, you'll go down to navigation. I'll open this in a new window. And I'm gonna go back to website now because I just want you to see what this website currently looks like. So I'm gonna look at the homepage that this Kajabi account came loaded with. I'm gonna click customize. And this is just the Kajabi page. Um, it has all this placeholder text. I haven't customized anything in it. And you'll notice here though that, um, actually let's preview this in a different window. So this page is connected to this account's blog page, login page, about me and contact pages. And that's because I created this navigation menu. So in the left-hand side panel under website navigation, this header navigation menu I set up to include blog, login, about me, and contact pages. 
So if I wanted to make another page available here, I go to add page and here are my options. Um, let's add library. So now when I refresh this page, you're going to see library there. So any page that you don't want appearing, like if you have a list of website pages and you just don't want one of them available, you can just remove it from this header navigation and it's, it won't be available to people anymore. And I mentioned that I don't like the homepage that Kajabi comes loaded with. I really, I don't like any of these website pages. Um, I just find the landing pages are a lot more flexible. So I use those as much as possible. But then the question is, how, how do you do that? Like, how do you get a different page to function as your homepage? Here, let's go back. Right, because this is the one right now that is defaulting to the homepage of this website. So I want to create a landing page and make it function as my homepage. So here under landing, and I already created this page, it's a landing page. Let's say this is the homepage for my business website. This is the one that I really want to function as my homepage. And here there's no header navigation. That's another difference between website and landing pages is that on a landing page, you can choose whether or not you want your header navigation to appear. And I do want it to appear. So I'm going to go into header. And I know that right now under desktop layout, I have my header hidden. And let's see, this one, just the default. And this is just a template page that Kajabi created. I want to use header navigation. Um, but they added these two navigation men or navigation menus yeah, to my header. So I'm going to get rid of that one. And then preview this landing page. Okay, so this is what I want functioning as my homepage, meaning that like in the case of my business, if somebody goes to www.elevatingexpertise.com, I don't want them going to this homepage that Kajabi created, and that's the default homepage. I want them going to this landing page. It's gonna serve as my homepage. So the way that you do that is go down to settings in Kajabi, and it's this first one, site details. I'm going to scroll down to homepage. So this is where you get to select which page to use as the homepage of your website. Right now it's, it's using the template homepage. That's the one that just came loaded with my Kajabi account. But here are my other options. I'm going to choose landing page. Once I do that, my list of landing pages is going to appear here. I want it to be homepage. So now I'll save. So what that means is that if somebody types in my domain, and this is a partner account, so it's not actually my business custom domain, but if they type this into this bar, they're going to be taken to this home page, not that template page that Kajabi came loaded with. So this is a landing page, but it's going to function as the home page for my business. And the only other pages that people can get to are ones that I make available by putting them in my header navigation menu. So that's how you use a navigation menu to turn pages into a website. And what's important to remember here is that you're the one deciding what pages are available and how you want people to navigate among those pages. You don't have to use the Kajabi default website pages. You don't have to use Kajabi's default navigation menu you can create the vision for what you want your website to look like and then make the tech work for you to implement that vision. So I hope this was helpful. Thank you so much for watching and I will see you next time.